What you acknowledge in your life is what rules over your life. You acknowledge poverty every day. So, Obiyama, Obiyama, Obiyama. The man, you go to be a big in our house. Oyama, Oyama, Oyama. I say, oh, oh, madam, you call me hello. Kaije, no, kaije, no, kaije. I decree over you. Whatever the enemy have held that belongs to you, that then I commanded, come out in the name of Jesus. I command your health to come back in the name of Jesus Christ. I command your blessings wherever it has scattered. Let your blessings come back in the name of Jesus Christ. Let your deliverance from satanic oppression come back in the name of Jesus Christ. Any of your children that are misbehaving, that the devil have taken over his or her life, wherever that boy, that girl, wherever they are, I command them to come back home. Let them come back home. Let them come back to normal. Let them begin to behave well. In the name of Jesus. Le pase kata makaya. Ye ke lama siti ya bakata. Le pragadi sopo. Te paka le broga la masa. Ye mahans kaya bo li kribo sita ya kata. Le progida basse. Tam pragada bosse. It is not yet over. It is not over. Re bragada bo. Re proga pasa. Re prokata basse. Whatever you have written off in your life, I am bringing life into it. In the name of Jesus. Kale pragada bose tere mokanda yaka. Le progatam prakasata yamaka. Le brogada santa. Le kraba sintro mose ke li braga. Em pragatam brose. This morning by the unction of the Holy Ghost, I lift my hands over you. Whatever that belongs to you, they have buried anywhere. Let the power of resurrection come upon that thing and receive it back in the name of Jesus. Receive it back in the name of Jesus. Receive it back in the name of Jesus. That your hell that is dead, that health is coming back to life. Whatever that is dead around you, which ought to be alive, let that thing receive life this morning. Let that thing receive life this morning. It is not yet over. Receive life this morning. Your testimony is coming this month. Your miracle is coming this month. Your divine visitation is coming this month. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Let there be deliverance. Take a boseka. Le pragata boska. Le basse. Something happened there. When Jesus said, Lazarus, comfort. He that was alive came back to life. He that was dead came back to life. Something happened. The Bible said, People have used grave cloth. To tie him, both his head, his land, his hand. Even though he was alive, he was still bound. And Jesus gave the last command, which I want to use to conclude. He said, you people that are bound Lazarus, lose him and let him go. Because your case is not over, I speak this morning. Whatever the enemy have used to bind you, bind your finance, your womb, your marriage, your academics, your career, I command you, you are loosed now. I lose you and let you go in the name of Jesus. I lose your children and let them go in the name of Jesus. I lose your health and let it be restored in the name of Jesus. I lose your career and let it manifest in the name of Jesus. Raise your two hands and receive your freedom. Receive it. Receive. Tell God I receive it. Rabazikata brokada bazankara bakata ya bakuria le brokada bansanta ya bakantara bashe 
Eli progadem bose kete malam bragada sekeri makaya. Le brogadamba kia basi e kete mosi kabragadamba. Le kreba santa ya makantro bose ke le bragadaba. Ye kabasa, receive your own. Don't joke about it. Something is happening. Whatever the yoke is, whatever the stone is, whatever grave cloth they have used, receive your own. By faith, say, Lord, I received it. I receive it. My case is not over. Yes, Lord, that hand with which you have received your miracle. Can you lay the two hands on your head? Lay your two hands on your head. Yes, Lord. You told me to pronounce it is not over. You told me to pronounce it is not over. I stand on this platform and this holy altar, our own Shiloh. I stand on this platform and declare your case is not over. Your matter is not over. This November, I lift my hands over you. No disaster will visit you this month. No calamity will visit you this month. You will not wear morning cloth in this November. Nobody will kill you this November. Nobody will kill any member of your family this November. Nobody will swindle you this November. Nobody will terrorize you this November. The enemy will not laugh over you this November. This month will bring good news to you. This month will bring open door to you. This month we bring favor to you. This month we bring healing to you. This month we bring promotion to you. This month we bring divine settlement for you. This month will be your month of jubilation. Sorrow will be far from you. Shame will not be your lot. You will live in abundance. Jehovah Jireh will be your provider. The man of war will fight your battle. The great I am will settle your matter. The resurrection and the life will give you life. Every negative prophecy over you will never come to pass. The Lord will fight for you. You will hold your peace. It is not over for you. You will laugh again. You will celebrate again. You will be fruitful again. You will give birth to children again. Your business will prosper again. Your family will live in peace again. You will marry as a young lady. Your husband will come. Your employment will come. Your destiny helper will come. Your ministry will explode. You will prosper. Spiritually, you will prosper. Morally, you will prosper. Academically, you will prosper. Financially, you will prosper. In marriage, you will prosper. In academics, you will prosper. In ministry, you will prosper. So shall it be.